Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Happy Monday. It is, I don't even know what time it is. 6.44 and I just got my workout done. Got up bright and early at 5 a.m. Actually, I was up at 4.50 to be exact. Lately, I've just been feeling the nudge to get up early and get my workout done while everyone's still asleep. Not every day, I was kind of thinking like two or three days a week. It totally depends on Shane's work schedule. Some days he works from home and other days he's gone by 5 a.m. So it just completely depends with his schedule, but it's always so nice to get up and get it done. I miss my 5 a.m. morning routine. If you guys remember a couple years ago, I was working out at 5 a.m. almost every single day and it was great. I was doing that. Lucy wasn't in school every day. A lot of it was through the summer and I have to be home by like 7 10 every day to get Lucy ready for school. So sometimes it's not the most practical but I got up in plenty of time today. Um, I didn't have a chance to snooze my alarm because Stella woke up at 4 50. That's why I was up. So I went upstairs, snuggled her, got her back to sleep and by the time I got her back to sleep it was 5 a.m. I walked downstairs to my alarm going off. So I was up already. Thank you, Stella, for not letting me snooze my alarm. But it felt great. I got a good workout in. And yeah, now I'm ready to dominate this Monday. It's actually Shane and I's wedding anniversary today. We've been married seven years today, which is mind-blowing. It feels like forever ago, but also feels like yesterday. But it is a Monday, so we don't really have anything planned. We were originally going to go on a trip for our anniversary this weekend. Um, I talked about that a few videos back, but we were gonna book a trip and just go somewhere for like three or four days But it just didn't work out. We couldn't decide where we wanted to go and then both the girls got sick and Stella got pneumonia and We just decided to scrap it and we figured we would figure it out later So Stella by the way is feeling good as new. She's like back to completely her normal self very grateful for that um, no more coughing, no more anything. I don't know what I have planned today. I'm assuming maybe Shane will take us girls out to eat tonight. I'm not sure. He took me on a date on Saturday and it was really fun. He, side note, Shane this year, he wrote down goals, which I did too, obviously. I did a whole video on that. But he has a whiteboard in his office area and it's just like goals that he has, like personal business. And one of the goals on the whiteboard is to do one date a month with me. And it made me literally so happy to see that. I appreciate it so much. I've been doing that. He goes out of his way to ask me on a date. He asked my mom to be a babysitter and we just go out for like a few hours. It's not like a big extravagant thing. Um, we just usually go to dinner and like get a drink together and it's so much fun. But since I do so much planning and organizing like of our family in general, it's just really nice to have him be thoughtful and do something like that. But I need to head home and if you're wondering why I made coffee this morning and did not drink it, um, that's because I made it for Shane. I feel like that is one of our very small love languages is making coffee for each other. And he said last night that he had his alarm set for 5.30 so I just decided to make that for him before I left. Your last clue is you have to find Lucy. That's what it says, that's so cute. Look at this. Mm, is she in here? <gasps> I found her. <laughs> Showing your drawing. You see her note? Yeah. Isn't she getting so good Literally at spelling? wrote it, like I could read it I know. all. She wrote me notes all day yesterday. Don't get the top of my head in that. <laughs> I haven't done your hair yet. <laughs> no. Happy anniversary. Thank you. Happy anniversary. Eight years, right? <laughs> yeah. It's seven years. Shane told Lucy last week, he was like, Mommy and Daddy have been married for eight years. And I was like, no, we haven't. But he was close. <laughs> Did you know it's Mommy and Daddy's anniversary? No. We got married seven years ago. Isn't that crazy? And how old are you? Five and a half. Five and a half. We had a lot of fun married time before we had kids, huh? No wasting time. <laughs>
having such a productive morning. I just got a little work done and then I wrote a gratitude list because I've been slacking at that lately. So I did that this morning and now I'm sitting here drinking coffee. It's 8.40 and Stella's still asleep. Also, guys, I got a new tree. I'm so excited. I have these two, can you really, you can't really see them. I have these two fiddles um, and I love them. It's been a lot of trial and error learning how to take care of them. They're pretty easy once you figure them out, but they're like a little bit tricky. I always told myself once I figured out how to actually take care of them like these, I would get a tree. And this one is so cute. I need to get a pot for it still. And there's balloons on my floor as always. Um, but I need to find a big pot or basket or something for it to go in. But I'm so excited about it. I love it so much. My friend Trista saw them at Sam's Club. Um, when she was there, I don't have a Sam's Club membership, but she was there and she posted them on her story and I didn't see it till like three hours after she was there and she went back and got me one. So I'm very appreciative that she did that because this tree was $74, I think. I posted about these being $74. So I was like, holy cow, I need that. Um, granted, that's more than I've ever spent on a plant, but I think I'm finally to the point in my plant life journey where I can spend a little money on the plants I really want. However, Shane was actually going to get me one of these for our anniversary. He, whoa, I almost spilled my coffee. He's going to get me a fiddle tree for our anniversary. And then he got home last week and I was so excited to tell him about my new tree. And he was like, oh, okay, I'm glad I didn't order that because that's what I was going to get you for our anniversary. So I stole his gift idea, but I love it a lot. I'm so happy with it. And yeah, I need to figure out where all this stuff's going to go because it's like packed in this window, but I love them a lot. Anyway, I think I just heard Stella, so I just wasted my few minutes of sitting here in silence on talking to my camera, but that's okay. Also, we finally brought the futon down from up in the playroom, and I swear I'm gonna work on that, but we need to take this to my sister's house, so we have it all folded up. Um, maybe we'll take that tonight, actually. We should add that to the list. I thought I heard her, but she is actually still asleep. So, I'm gonna sit here and drink some coffee. Did you sleep in? Yeah. Say good morning. Good morning. You're cutie. <laughs> you go downstairs. Get your pull-up off. Yeah, I wear my underwear. You want to wear underwear? Perfect. Hi. I heard Stelly. <laughs> good morning. Good morning, Daddy Bell. Pink? Pink? Yeah. <laughs> so pretty. I'm so glad you slept good. Bacon? Just in time. That's you. That's me? Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Well, anniversary breakfast. Those buttons. I showered, I changed, I curled my hair, and now I'm in my half bath. And I figured out a couple weeks ago that the stool that we have in here for the girls to wash their hands is like the perfect height for me to sit here with my makeup in the sink and I can still see myself in the mirror. It's a game changer. And now I've just been doing my makeup in here lately and it's been so good. So I figured that I would do my makeup with you for anniversary, not that we have any plans, but figured I would do a little more than I usually do. So on a normal day, I just take my It Cosmetic CC Cream, I take half of this, and then I take half of my whatever confidence in a cream, face cream is from It Cosmetics, and I mix them together, and I rub them on my face, and that's my face makeup. Today, however, I'm gonna change it up, but today I'm gonna wear my Estee Lauder Double Wear. This is like my tried and true, forever favorite foundation but it's very full coverage so i don't like to wear it all the time but i'm gonna wear this and then i got a mini of this hollywood flawless filter the charlotte tilbury i'm gonna put this on first and then i'm gonna put a little bit of my estee lauder double wear on speed this up it's pretty self-explanatory you don't really need me to talk you through it so here i go Now I'm 
I am feeling so much better. I just got Stella changed at, what time is it? 11.55. <laughs> but I'm up in the playroom right now with Stella and Shane actually put the day bed together for up here. And I think I'm finally gonna paint. <laughs> I think I finally have an idea in my head of what I wanna do up here. I've had an idea for a while, but I couldn't narrow it down. Like I had a few different ideas, but I think I finally have an idea. And with the girls getting sick, it pushed everything back. But now I'm ready. And since Shane put this together for me, it just like motivated me to get the room done. It's so cute. Um, I don't have a mattress in here yet. It's We're just sitting on like the bottom part of it, but we're gonna get a mattress in here and it's gonna be so comfy and cozy. Hey. Uh. Who's on your shirt? And Val. And Val? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I love you. Looked back at that clip and I see there's like a hole in my eyebrow that I need to go fill in. And my lashes are on their last leg. Three weeks since I've gotten them filled, so they're basically non existent. But I can't decide if I want to get them refilled or if I just want to take a break from them for a while. They make me feel so much better about myself, but also I kind of just want to be able to wash my face like normal. Might take a little break from them and take them off tonight, but I don't know. I can't decide. They're barely there. You can probably hardly tell. I wanted to show you these really cute rings that I got off Etsy last week. I'm obsessed with them and I've been wearing them every day. And I just got Lulu on the top one and Stella on the bottom. I've been wearing these on my middle finger. It's just easier to show you on my thumb. I ordered these in the middle of the night a couple weeks ago when Stella was up coughing all night with pneumonia. And it was a very good random purchase. I wanted a set of rings like this for a while, so I'm very happy with them. I will leave the link down below for you guys. Um, but I love them. I'm gonna clean up the kitchen a little bit and we are gonna take the girls out to dinner tonight. We're gonna go on a little family date. <laughs> Bring you along on that. But for now, I need to clean up a little bit and get a little bit of laundry done. Very exciting things. Okay, you're definitely crooked, but I just got on a cosmetics website because I'm almost out of my favorite CC cream to get a shade darker since it's getting warmer out. So I'll probably self tan a little more often. Um, but it's 30% off today. I don't know if this is actually on the website, but I got a code in my email and I'm assuming you can use it, but the code is save 30. I always get this on their website cause they always have sales. And if there's not a sale going on, I wait until there is a sale cause they do it so often. Just wanted to share that. I'll leave the link down below. Um, but that's a good deal. Dad's trying to make us turn down Jojo Siwa so he can work. Lame. Every girl's a super girl. Oh, thank you. Did you pick flowers? Mommy, my. Mmm, smells good. On a family date for our anniversary, we just had to lug this giant futon into Shane's truck. It's a lot heavier than it looks. Um, and now he's on the phone. I'm just waiting for him to come outside. So my deck is a monstrosity right now. It's on the never ending list of things to do, but not today. Is that your name? Okay, it's the next morning now and I never finished filming this video last night. We ended up dropping that futon off at my sister's house and then we went out to dinner, the four of us. And then we came back home, we got the girls to bed and Shane and I finished watching Avatar, kind of random, but we rented it on Saturday night. Side note, don't rent it. <laughs> we rented it on Amazon Prime, but it's wow. actually on Disney Plus. But since I have the parental control set up on Disney Plus, like so the girls can't watch PG-13 movies, um, it didn't pop up when I searched it, but don't rent it if you have Disney Plus because it is on there. I don't know if anyone's like seeking out to watch Avatar. I had never seen it. And when we went to Animal Kingdom at Disney World, 
um, they have the whole, what's it called? I don't even remember what the place is called, but um, we rode Flight of Passage, the Avatar ride, and it was so much fun. And Shane was like, oh my gosh, I forgot that I love this movie. So Saturday night, we decided to watch it after um, our date, but I cannot hang for a three hour movie pretty much ever. But especially I cannot do that when we didn't start it till 10 o'clock at night. So we finished it last night when we got home from dinner after the girls went to sleep. And that was good. The end was really good. I think they could probably cut out a solid half hour of that movie. I'm going to be honest, but it was, it was very good. Nonetheless, <laughs> Stella, you're funny. And then Shane gave me a back massage. He is amazing at massages. He's so good at it. Like I would rather have him give me a back massage than pay a professional. That's how good he is at them. And that was that. So I thought I needed to close out this video since I never finished it, never filmed any other clips. Um, Stella and I have just been getting stuff done this morning. I've had such a long to-do list that I'm dominating, I'm gonna be honest. Number one thing on my to-do list was to get this video edited and uploaded, so it's all edited now. We just need to upload. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!